Hey everybody, it's Mike here coming to you from good old Courtney Mazda, great place to be. This is a little video for all you great people out there, all you wonderful people checking us out from the comfort of your own home. This is a 2020, 2020, four. 2024 Mazda CX-5 Sport Design. Check it out in rhodium white. I love that rhodium white paint. It'll show up nice and bright for other drivers to see you. Uh, the Sport Design package gives you really nice equipment. It's got a painted black trim along around the wheel wells and down along the bottom sill there. You got painted black rims. Um, painted black rims and trim. And then you got a four-wheel disc brake system, fully independent suspension. It's got a nice all-season Toyo tire with a mud and snow rating. You can drive this vehicle all year round. Uh, a couple other things. It's got a little button on the door to lock or unlock the car when you're approaching it. It also has a signal lamp built into the outside rear view mirror to let other drivers know what your intentions are. In the inside of the rear view mirror, you've got another light that comes on here, your blind spot monitoring system. So heated mirrors that gives you all kinds of lights and, and features up front here. Love the styling of that CX-5, it never gets old. Uh, up on, underneath the hood is an engine, a fuel efficient turbocharged motor producing uh, up to 320 foot pounds of torque, 250 horsepower with premium fuel. If you put regular in it, you're down to 310 foot pounds of torque and you drop your horsepower down to 220. Uh, nice headlights here, LED lights, they'll turn as you go around corners, automatic high beam, low beam. Behind the Mazda symbol there is plexiglass, is your adaptive cruise control, so you can set the speed and set it and forget it, you'll, you'll adapt to the same speed as the driver in front of you, which is really, really handy, especially if you're on the inland highway just to go for a cruise. Up in the windshield here, you got all sorts of cameras and more radars and sensors to stop the vehicle, help stop the vehicle in the event of collision. Uh, lane departure warning system and all that kind of stuff is up there. Check out the passenger side. That paint is absolutely beautiful. It just glistens. Nice glow to the paint. Nice and bright, that white. Nice contrast with the tinted windows and the black trim along the bottom and the rims. Up front here in the, in the, uh, in the passenger seat, you got a fully adjustable seat. You can go up and down, forward and back, recline. Uh, you got a nice perforated leather to sit on perforated and solid bolsters those bolsters will really uh hold you in the seat nice especially when you're going around corners we got some nice all-weather floor mats in there you got a little bit of that red stitching wherever you look up and on the dash and everywhere check out the door panel you got that nice brushed aluminum it's got a pretty nice little sound system in here as well uh roadside assistance really really cool all right so i'm gonna get into the back seat and tell you a little bit more about what that's like jumping in and out of the back the door opens up nice and wide Getting in and out back here is real easy. Um, great space back here. Having owned one of these myself, I can tell you I fit four guys my size, if not bigger, and four sets of clubs. We did it because we also have this really cool 40-20-40 uh, rear split folding seat. So you can put just the middle seat down if you want. It does have armrests with some cup holders. You got your heated seats and two high-powered USB-C charging points or USB charging points. Lots of ventilation back here. Good visibility, especially if you're the driver. Check out those nice big tall windows. And there's the spot to be, folks, right behind the steering wheel. Uh, it's a fun car to drive. They're very fuel efficient and super, super safe. It's a top pick from the Insurance Institute for Highway and Safety. Let's go check out the hatch. So, coming back to the hatch of the vehicle, you got LED tail lights, uh, dual exhaust, tinted windows, Nice big wiper up the back there. You got the backup camera that sits back here as well. High mount brake light uh, back here. There's your carpet mats from the factory. It looks like this this uh, rear cargo board's been flipped around, so you can have it on carpet flooring or you can have it on plastic flooring. Check out the Bose sound system sub that they put right into the built it right into the spare tire. You got some more storage back here and stuff like that too. Plus, it's got those. This great feature that 40 20 40 split folding seat you got quick releases to move the seats down in a hurry here so just try that out poof and away it goes down it goes so that's the back end of this cx5 you just push the button and close it up there's a few ways to close it you can use the button or you can use your key or you can use the spot in front of the driver's seat there okay i'm going to tell you a little bit more about what it's like as a driver so getting in and out nice height to get in and out of real easy uh, lots of adjustments you can do on the seat. It's also got 
up to four different positions you can memorize for the seat, one for each key, and then two more on the seat itself. So you can have up to four different drivers all saved in different memory, memorized seating positions. Um, down here in front of my knee is your, you can turn off the lane departure warning system. You can open and close the rear hatch there. There's all your power windows and power locks. And as I was mentioning before, in the outside rear view mirror, a little light comes on to let you know when someone's coming up beside you. That's your blind spot monitoring system. You got a nice leather wrapped steering wheel, automatic headlights, rain sensing wipers. You got paddle shifters if you want to select gears on the steering wheel here. Stereo controls and next song, previous song, voice commands. And then over here you got your adaptive cruise control. It also has a heads up display. I don't know if you can see anything in the windshield there, but I can adjust. See if I got this. Yeah, it's hard to see, but it basically gives you the same information on the windshield there as it does. Yeah, you can't really see it. There it is. I just had the camera in the wrong angle. So there's your heads up display. It kind of floats out there. You can see your speed, your navigation directions, your speed limits, wherever you go. It's basically taking the information on the dash here and putting it right in front of you so you don't have to look down. It's safer that way. Uh, adaptive cruise control, steering cruise control, voice commands and all that kind of stuff on the steering wheel. Then down over here, you got your heated seats, ventilated seats, heated steering wheel. It comes with factory nav, but it does have a wireless Android Auto Apple CarPlay uh, system. So you can just set up your, your stereo right in there the way you go. It also has a wireless charging pad, electronic gear selector down here if you want to shift gears, or you can do it on the steering wheel. Multiple drive modes means you can have it in sport mode, which will keep your RPMs up a little bit higher before they shift, giving you access to a bit more horsepower easily to get. And then you got normal, which will be the most fuel efficient. You can just put it in normal for full time if you want. And then if you want to go into off road mode, that'll lock your rear differential and make it full time four wheel drive. Of course, the all wheel drive system that's in here will just kick in, in on and off as needed. Uh, you don't really ever have to put it into all wheel drive mode or off road mode, but if you do, it'll just give you that much more traction. Last but not least here, folks, let's try out the stereo system. Okay, we got to have find something where they're actually playing some music. Let's see here. Uh, oh, yeah, there we go. That's it. That thing rocks. That's got a really nice sound system, Bose sound system. Really cool, that's the 2024 Mazda CX-5 Sport Design. If you or somebody you know might be in the market for one of these, please give me a call, 250-338-5777. Email me, mike at courtneymazda.com. Thanks for watching everybody and have a great day.